I'm very proud to be sharing IFLA's new strategy with you today. The development of the strategy really has been a team effort. It reflects the comments from our members and volunteers. In fact, there were over 2,000 inputs through six surveys and five consultations, as well as extensive discussion within the governing board. It is a terrific example of my presidential theme at work, Stronger Together. With your input, we have a document that is stronger, more relevant and better suited to take our Federation through to its centenary in three years' time. This strategy has a key role to play in the agenda that I set out when I took on my presidency. We want to make IFLA more understandable and to bring it closer to the people, institutions and associations that are IFLA. The strategy does this by providing a simpler structure, more focused on what we want to see in the library field and in the world as a whole in the future, and more adaptable to our members and volunteers. We also have a clear vision, which I hope will provide both a unifying focus for our field, but also a clear indication for, for our partners of what we are about and our ambitions. These attributes combined will, I believe, help to achieve my own goals and those of the governing board of ensuring that IFLA is well set for the future. Of course, now the challenge is to implement the work and we will have a dashboard to help track progress and we will report back to you on that progress. Success, however, will require all of us to mobilise to ensure that we have vibrant professional communities, a strong voice and partnerships and the ability to deliver at all levels. I'm looking forward to hearing how you are helping through your work to build sustainable futures for all through knowledge and information. Mm -hmm.